Hi, my name is Dr. Ashok Mittal and I am a neonatologist and pediatrician right here in Medical Super Speciality Hospital, Kolkata. So today we are going to speak on how uh, the air pollution affects children and their lives globally and mostly in India. A lot of uh, patients, uh, children patients come to us uh, with the problems that are caused by air pollution and the parents are very bothered that the child cannot sleep in the night and sometimes have to miss schools and the school performance drops down and uh, sometimes they may have breathing difficulties which uh, fills up the entire criteria of childhood asthma. They sometimes may need uh, anti-allergics, bronchodilators and sometimes nebulizers or uh, inhalers as well. Now this is something which is very important to also know that uh, just not the minor illnesses or bronchial asthma uh, recently, some of the WHO data have shown that some countries have reported increased incidence of childhood death also related to air pollution in children. When we talk about uh, the matters related to air pollution, we talk about PM10 and uh, basically the particulate matters and the ozone. Um, in the particulate matter, what bothers most as a pediatrician for me, for my children patients, is the PM 2.5 because that is something which goes easily into the lungs. We can prevent it certainly by making government propositions and uh, resolutions related to traffic pollution, related to technologies uh, used in your daily cooking and daily um, uh, <clears throat> usage of uh, fuels because you have to remember that the future of this country or any country is children and that is precisely the age group which is most vulnerable. Their, their lungs have not been developed properly. It takes about six to seven years to develop uh, the complete lungs in its entirety. And um, this is the time when they are mostly outdoors and they are most vulnerable because of the exposure to air pollution.